with nobody. The president can't do with nobody. The Congress can't do with nobody. Yes, 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 yes. They sung, I give myself away. I want to be used. I, I can raise your hand if, if you just really want to be used by God. I ain't talking about just sit and look, but I want to be used. Use me, Lord. Everything be ain't off the table. That nothing may come home before table on it, 
oh God. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. And let the people of God say, Amen. 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 I'll be dealing with the subject, the mind factor. The mind factor. How many believe that your mind is, to the computer, is a CPU? which means central processing unit. Yes, your mind. Your, your, your mind tells your hand, and your mind, every signal that goes on through your body, it comes through the mind. Even when people say, I'm gonna give you a piece of my what? Mind. And, and some people may blast you out or cuss you out, but all those images, all those words, and all that was in them is comes from the mind first. Yes. And some of that's in their heart. So that's why they speak the way they do it. That's why they talk the way they do it. And that's why they respond to opposition the way they do it. It's because they got to get the mind straight. All right. Many people are functioning day in and day out, but yet and still, their mind is all messed up. And that's why the Bible says, in whose case, the God of what? This world has blinded the minds. That's why you see so many marriages that's women and women and men and men going on. And I our president is approving some of this stuff. Why? It's because of the mind of people. Wickedness in what we call high places. So sometimes you read scripture, you don't realize, you, you may read it this time and read it that time, but then all of a sudden you get a deeper meaning of what the scripture is really saying. So sometimes when we say uh, wickedness in high places, that means it starts from the government first and then the truth is all the way down. And many times people, even Christians, are saying yes to this, that is sinful and yes to that, but yet it's still on the other side of the coin. Now they want to talk about prayer. Now they want to talk about fasting. Now they want to talk about submission. Why yet it's still, they are high five and with Satan. It's a mind factor. Yes, yes. Everything is in the mind. See, that's why you got to be careful what you're allowed to go to enter your mind. That's why you got to be careful in this conversation that you entertain. Why? Because the devil has blinded us. So that's why some of us don't want nobody to talk to us when we got trouble in our life or some of the decisions that we make. We say, oh, you just judging me. No, I'm making judgment. That means I'm discerning the situation. It's a mind factor. And many times people's mind is, is so polluted it was so much stuff and it's just like the computer. And, and how many know that they have a computer and if you, if you leave your computer unprotected, what happens? You get a virus. See, see, see the antivirus to the computer is McAfee, capacitive, and, and the rest of them in Norton. See, see, those are good for the natural computer. But when you need an antivirus, for yourself, for your soul, for your spirit. Now we need the Bible. This is our antivirus. This, this is this is what we download into our hard drive to, to wipe out and, and as some in the computer say the debugging of the system. In other words, I'm getting I'm working the bugs out because why wow, I'm in my word and, and, and the word is getting in me. See, you don't need to get in the word if the word ain't gonna come on something. Right? I come by that silly rock. Preacher, I'm glad you asked. Right. You start coming to church more often. So you know 